My name is Ashley and welcome to my channel. Today's video we are going to be doing an unboxing um, and this is actually a new company that I have never tried out before so I'm really excited to open up this box. The box I have today, I just dropped it on the floor. Today we are going to be opening up my Yume Twins box. So this box, um, they do a different theme for each month, and the June box was themed for a Studio Ghibli lunch date. So it was, um, I guess, like, like a lunch bag, some bento boxes and stuff that was all themed for Studio Ghibli characters, which I love. I love Studio Ghibli movies. I have my little Totoro guy back here, and um, I think the theme for this one, you could get either Totoro or... Um, Kiki's Delivery Service. I think those were like the two movies that they had featured. Um, so I'm really excited to open this up and see what items I got in this box. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and bring this up to the camera and give you guys a quick little close up of the actual box itself. So here's what the front or the top of the box looks like. This is like the front flap that we would open up like this. Um, I did already cut the tape as you can see. And then we have on the sides just the, all these really cute little designs as well. And same thing on this side. They have packing information, like, like shipping information on the back and the bottom, so I'm not going to show that stuff. So this box was about $48 um, after shipping and everything. So, uh, you know, international shipping does get pretty expensive. All right, so we're going to go ahead and open this on up and see what's inside. I just dropped the packing information. Okay, well on the top like flap, it does say konnichiwa, and then spread the kawaii love, post and tag, hashtag you my twins. So pretty cool. Um, there is no like packing paper or anything to hide the item, so everything is just right there for me to see. Um, let me grab the paper information that I dropped though. Okay, so on the top they had this one, this little um, note here that says, that there's some items that you can win so you just scan the little QR code and then you can possibly win some extra items so I don't know if it's just like all these items they have featured here but that's pretty cool they give you a chance to get some more stuff and then they have the Ghibli lunch date pamphlet so I think this is gonna be kind of what goes into all of the details of the box so it says scan me for a surprise and then um, so you can actually get different prizes and it looks like here are some of the prizes. Um, yep and then it does go into what's inside the box. So let's go ahead and dig on in. Okay so the first thing I'm pulling out it looks like it's this little um, like a little bag like a little drawstring bag and it has Totoro on it. That is so cute. So let's see, um, it says it's a Totoro floral cloth wrap. So heading out for lunch, wrap your lunch box with one of these three Totoro cloth wraps. Um, crafted using durable materials with cute patterns, they'll give your lunch some major kawaii vibes. And then it even gives like a little demonstration on how to actually use this bag because I've never used anything like this before. Just taking it out of the plastic so we can get a good look at it. So here is the bag. It's actually pretty, it's a pretty small bag, but it is adorable. So um, it has Totoro, it says my neighbor Totoro. We've got some little like sprites there as well. The back is just the same. Um, it does have handles on it, so that's cute. And then it also has these little like drawstrings so you can like cinch the bag up. So it did say that there was like one of three options that you can get for this type of bag. There was either a bottle wrap, a cloth wrap, or the drawstring cloth wrap, which is what I got. So this is really cute. I actually really, really like this little bag. Okay, the next item I'm pulling out is a bento box. It's just like a normal sized bento. And it also is a My Neighbor Totoro one. So it is just like this foresty green kind of color. It has My Neighbor Totoro, and then it features Totoro holding the umbrella, and then the little baby Totoros at the bottom. So cute. And then here is the inside. It is just plain green. So this one says it's a uh, microwave container in size large. 
Not only does the kawaii kitchenware serve as a trusty bento or lunchbox, but it also shines as storage for leftovers. Thanks to the handy dome lid, you'll always have extra space too. Pop the air vent open, so I guess that's what this little thing right here on the top is, this little flap. Um, so pop the air vent open when you're ready to heat up food in the microwave and you're good to go. Comes in a Totoro or a Gigi design. So there's two different Totoro designs and then there's two Gigi designs. And I obviously got the green Totoro design. So this is really, really cute. So next up we have another bento box and this is a small one. It says it's the microwave container small. It's adorned in a Totoro or a Gigi design. This item is the perfect size for snacks on the go, just like its large, just like with its larger counterpart, it has a handy dome lid, so you'll always have that bit of extra space. So this one is really cute. It's that same green color as the large one, and then on the top it says my neighbor Totoro, and it has like the little baby Totoros there. It also has like this little uh, vent lid, I guess. So if you needed to heat up something little tiny, that's perfect. Like. A little bit of leftover rice or something maybe and then here is the inside and when it says it has the dome lid you can kind of see here like the lid does pop up a bit so there is a little extra room if you have something piled up kind of high but I do like that they sent me the the little box that matches the big box I just think that it's I don't know I like things to be matching and I think that this set is really cute so I'll definitely be able to get some use out of these. Um, I am actually back in the office now. Uh, I was working from home for like a little over a year, um, but I'm back in the office now. I'm in actually a new position that kind of requires me to be in the office. I'm working with new associates, helping to you know train them in different things. So this is really fun. Um, this will be a fun thing to bring to lunch or bring to work with my lunch in it. Okay, there are still a couple more things left in the box. So the next thing I am pulling out is actually this little mug. So it says it's a Totoro floral mug. Sip your favorite drink with Totoro. Suitable for both microwave suitable for both microwave and dishwasher use. The best part of this Japan-made mug is that it's crafted with antibacterial technology and it's heat proof up to 284 degrees Fahrenheit. Wow, that's pretty uh pretty hot. I don't know if I would drink something that was that hot. Anyways, let me go ahead and take this out of the packaging. So here's what the little mug looks like. I like this little like handle detail. I'm not sure if this actually serves a purpose, but um, maybe to like tie it onto something. Um, but the design is really cute. It's actually the same design pretty much as the little drawstring bag that I got. So I think that that's adorable. And here's the inside it is just plain it is a very very small cup it doesn't say like how many ounces it is oh it's a uh, it's 200 milliliters so it's pretty tiny but it's perfect if you have like I don't know if you're just gonna be sipping like green tea or something which I don't do often especially right now it's summertime I'm not gonna be drinking any hot teas um, but this is still really cute I adore this all right so there is still one item left in the box and it is a hot and cold lunch bag. So make lunchtime extra special with this Gigi or Totoro insulated lunch bag. A double zip fastener makes it easy to open and close and the material is expandable so you'll be able to carry every last one of your goodies. So that's really cute. Um, let me go ahead and take this one out of the packaging. And this is funny because everything that they've sent me had been Totoro related, but they gave me a GG lunch bag <laughs> to put all my Totoro lunch boxes in. So that's kind of funny. I, because everything else is Totoro themed, I kind of wish that the lunch bag had been Totoro themed as well, but I absolutely love Gigi, so I'm not upset about this in the slightest. Okay, so I got the lunch bag all popped open. It is this really cute like gray lunch bag and it has like the pink handles and then pink zipper detailing. So on the front here we have Gigi with all these little like flowers around him and then this really cute like bordering on the bottom that just kind of carries all the way around and then on the back it says Kiki's Delivery Service super cute and then here is the inside it does have a little pocket and it is definitely insulated <laughs> 
It is a pretty small size lunch bag, but um, I guess like if you're using the, the little bento boxes that they sent, then everything would probably fit perfectly in here. All right guys, so that was everything in my You May Twins Studio Ghibli or Ghibli lunch date box. Um, I really enjoyed this box. All of these items are so cute. These are two of like my favorite uh, Studio Ghibli movies, uh, Totoro and Kiki's Delivery Service. So that was just perfect. Um, I guess if I had to have like one negative about the items, it's just like the size of everything is pretty tiny. Um, but they are so, so cute and I definitely will get use out of all of these items. If I had to pick a favorite item, it actually might be like this little drawstring bag. I don't know why, I just love like the design of it and maybe it's right now because I'm having all my summer vibes, but it's just very summery and you can still, I can still use this for more than just, you know, like lunch. I can put other things in here too if I need. So I think that this is really, really cute. But I love all of the items so much. So um, this was the only, I kind of put my subscription service with UMA Twins on pause for now. Um, just to see, get a feel for this kind of a box and then, you know, I'll see what other themes they come up with in the future and I might, you know, just get them here and there as I see fit or as, you know, I find items or different themes that I like. But I really enjoyed this box. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have ever gotten a box from Yume Twins, if you guys gotten this box from Yume Twins. Um, and if not, just what was your favorite item of this box? Did you like any of the items? Would you ever consider trying this subscription service? I know that like right now, um, things with subscription boxes are a little bit crazy, um, especially in the Disney community. So. I don't know I think I'm having fun trying out these like Japan boxes they are really cute and they're just I don't know they're like super fun but anyways that's enough from me for right now if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and if you haven't already please consider hitting that subscribe button I would love to have you as a part of this little Disney YouTube family here Anyways guys, thank you all so so much for watching. I hope you are having a magical day and I will talk to you all next time. Bye!